Hi, this is Nina, and I am the owner of Gertie's Gourmet Popcorn. Gertie's Gourmet Popcorn is a crave-worthy popcorn shop that sells popcorn in many, many varieties. We thought that that would be important to uh, sell popcorn in many varieties because most popcorn shops don't. So to set us apart, we decided to do just that. So we sell popcorn in many varieties such as um, the Chicago mixed cheese and caramel, a regular caramel. We also sell a uh, Cinnabon popcorn uh, that tastes exactly like a cinnamon bun. We sell a red velvet cake popcorn, rainbow beach popcorn with can, we have many colors. We also sell bacon, pecan, caramel popcorn and clusters. We sell funnel cake. We're doing a lot with popcorn and we are putting our creative minds together to give the consumer what they have been craving for you know so that is what we are doing we have obtained our location in waukegan the address of our location is 910 north green bay road in waukegan illinois uh, it is in Grandview Courts, and our neighbors is Jewel Osco, also Cali Nails, also uh, Midwest Dental, if you are familiar with the Waukegan area. You know, bringing this popcorn shop to the community um, uh, was going to be a, a great uh, resource for young people. And we see that the outlook for the future of Waukegan is promising with Gertie's Gourmet Popcorn as a resource to promote economic growth and change in our Lake County communities with an emphasis on youth development. This will ensure a safe, healthy, thriving city by strengthening and empowering our youth in workforce. We need to bring our young people into the working environment. We need to have some place where they can come, some place where they can work, where they can learn, where they can be the best versions of themselves that they can possibly be. Many of them, this would be their very first jobs uh, working. You know, there's so much that's happening in our communities. Uh, there's so much happening in our state, in our world, all over. And it's happening in the lives of our young people. I feel that, you know, being a leader in the community and being a, even a leader in ministry, it is our moral and ethical responsibility to provide these young people with the tools necessary that they need to live, grow, and to thrive. So with our empowerment program and youth development, within our popcorn shop, we are going to be teaching them like life skills. We're going to be teaching them things like, you know, uh, being responsible uh, uh, co-workers, being a good, having a good work ethic, teaching them interpersonal skills, how to talk and communicate with other people, how to be good stewards, you know, how to give and pour into your community, how to be on time for work, be prepared for work, how to, you know, uh, present yourself even on job interviews. We want to teach them how uh, the skills necessary that they need uh, as they develop and as they grow. This is the main core. This is the breath. That, so our youth development piece for uh, Gertie's Gourmet Popcorn is the life and breath and backbone of our company, of what we do and why we're doing it. So not only are we selling crave worthy, delicious popcorn of many, many varieties, handmade and, and, and you know, our community and, and other people in other states, they love it. They order all the time. Not only are we selling great popcorn, but we are developing a people, a community of people, a community of young people that need a, a way out, that, that need mentorship and leadership. You know, um, there's so much that's happening in the world today. Every time we turn on the news, every time we turn on the TV, you know, we, we're, we're hearing about, you know, someone being killed. Some these kids are being shot. They're going into young people going into schools, shooting up the schools because they don't have the proper guidance. They don't have the proper resources. Nobody is hearing them out. They don't have a voice. They're suffering through depression and no one knows. And then when something happened, then 
all hell seems to break loose and we want to jump on board and say, we need to do something. Well, Gerties want to do something. We want to give young people a way uh, out. We want to bring them into an environment that's that's healthy, an environment that's that's loving, that's uh, you know that's that's uh, building our community, that's pouring back into our community. We want to be the light that shines in a dark place. So you know we are trying to get our doors open as quickly as possible. I'm getting emails and text messages, and you know uh, when are you all opening up? We're looking. We drove past, and the place is not open yet. You know we are. Uh, needing help, you know, our construction is the only piece that is needed to get our, our uh, get to get the job done, to get the doors open. So um, we are going to be doing a gun GoFundMe page to get our construction bill done. So our construction team can come in and delight everyone that's going to uh, frequent or come and visit and buy popcorn from Gertie's and uh, also be um, uh, welcomed in by our, our young people that is so looking forward to you all uh, coming in. So thank you so much. You're going to see a link uh, uh, for the GoFundMe for our construction build. We would appreciate it uh, wholeheartedly if you can help us in getting to where we're going to get our doors open. God bless you. You know, I thank you so much for taking the time to listen to, uh, you know, this message of Gertie's and what we're trying to do for our community. Um, and we look forward to hearing from you very soon. Thank you. Goodbye.